How much time do you usually spend creating and updating products in your store? It's high time to set yourself free from this routine. Let's take a look how the XML and C3 import add-on can help you. Here is an example import that I have created. I simply specify the file in XML or C3. Also, I set up my margin which is my interest. For example, I add 4% to reward classes from the catalog. I choose the fill, the categories I want to import, and the cron script, which will update the products for me in my store. That's it. Let's see how it works with a real XML file. I go to manage XML and C3 import and create one more import. I will be using a catalog of a real supplier. As the catalogs are usually located somewhere on the web, you will get a link from your supplier. I copy it, choose URL, and insert it here. Let's give it a name, for example, supplier2. We can choose a language, also the delimiter. A delimiter is a special sign that shows the route from a category to a subcategory, like this one. And set up your margin. For example, five doors to every product. Let's create and do the fields mapping. The fields of a catalog and the fields of the sales card store may not uh, be the same. That is why you can create field mapping. So you can choose here the name. In my case, it is title. It is a real catalog, so as you can see, there is a difference. I will choose a category because the categories of a store and of a catalog may be different. And for example, I will choose product code and the price. I will not be importing the images because it may take quite a lot of time. I click save. A catalog may have multiple categories with subcategories and so on. That is why we have created a special feature that is called category mapping and it allows you to create new categories or link uh, the categories from the catalog to the categories from your store. Let's see how it works. Here is a big list of the categories from the catalog. You can see there are lots of them. You can also create a new category if you want to by clicking create and choosing a place uh, where the category will be created. For example, here. Let's create. You can see below that a new category has been created automatically. You can also link a category uh, with another category so that the products will be imported to the existing category. For example, to this one. I'm choosing it. So I have linked a category. You can do it like this in bulk and select all categories to make it faster and for example click create category i will disable this tick and create category for example interview travel now we will click import as you can see some categories have been linked automatically with the root level of your store now let's do the import. It will take some time to do it, but of course it will be faster than if you were doing it manually. I will pause the recording for now. It took me about a minute to import over 1000 products. Of course I was doing it without the images because the images weigh a lot. Now the import is completed and you can see how many new objects have been created also how many were updated. Let's save. 
Interact tab you can see a cron script. A cron script allows you to update the product. For example, you can update the prices every day and update the old catalogs only once a week. And the system will be doing it for you. You will have time to enjoy yourself instead of doing any import. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, please feel free to ask me if you have any questions about this add-on. Also, you may have doubts if your catalog, the catalog of your vendor, will work with this add-on. Uh, please don't worry. Uh, the cost of the add-on includes the adaptation of the add-on to your catalog. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our channel for more tips for your CSK store. Goodbye.